Welcome back, everybody, to another horrifying, exciting episode of The Forest. Episode number three. And wherever you may be around this planet, I hope you're doing well. I bid you good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. And for me, it is 2 o'clock in the afternoon here in the United States of America. I'm on the east coast of America, and I'm located in New York. And so... The topic of today's episode is Peaceful Mode, and therefore the title is Peaceful Mode is Not Peaceful Mode. Okay, and with that being said, TGIF, and it's Friday, and we are going to host a game, we're going to continue. And I'm just going to show you guys that peaceful mode is not peaceful mode in the forest. Um, I put my server on peaceful mode. As you see, they, they say peaceful underneath all of them. And um, I'm going to allow eight players on the server. We'll see if anybody joins. And uh, it, it should be pretty fun because... It's been getting busier. The game has been. There's been a bigger community lately. Um, I was playing this game a couple years ago. Few, a few years ago, actually. Um, might be even five now. Okay, so... We're going to go in. It only takes a minute to load. And there it goes. And so, enjoy. And there's the sounds of the environment as we load in. Okay. At least I'm where it's warm. Right? So... I'm gonna go with controller on this. I don't need my pad. <laughs> I do need something to eat though. So I'm just gonna munch on this. And uh Oh yeah, I'm on the boat. I'm by the boat. See how I can pick up the feather there? Birds drop random feathers. And it's dark. And I'm going to turn my DPI down just one. I am so awaiting the release of um, Sons of the Forest. Can't wait. We're going to swim in the shore here. Okay, so I might as well... Grab out. Well, you know what? It's just much easier. They're just 
dead instantly that way. And it doesn't take long. So... Okay. And this is a first person view. Basically, your character takes the meat. I can take the shells if I want to, but I'm not. I'm not making any uh, water things right now. Okay, so that meat's laying there, and I don't like to waste my food. So um, I had a fire pit at one point. Uh, there it is. Yep, I'm on fire. I can burn money. And if you push tab, you can see who's on the server. So, alright, back to what I was doing here. So, I'm gonna throw some leaves on there. We'll cook these up and get back over here. look a little to the left of the food and it'll bring your illustrations up here. Okay, so there's more food. And basically I'm gonna leave that food there. Keep the fresh that I have. And we're gonna go someplace where I can show you that peaceful mode is not peaceful mode. So that's where we're heading right now. Matter of fact, let's see. Um. Is it the one further out? Yeah, because, I mean, there's sharks and everything in this game. So, okay, I actually know where we'll go. Yeah, see, there's a cave down there. And I think that's where you... I can't re remember, but... Is it the katana? I can't remember. There's something important over there. Um, basically, all my markers are caves. The yellows are. They're caves in important spots um, that I learned from... YouTube tutorials uh, a few years back when I went to find all the gun parts and the katana and the crossbow and or the modern bow anyway and there's the katana but yeah I like it so I hope you guys are enjoying the content so far. I'm 
just running in the night here. This is my main uh, recreational base. You know, we have our campfire here, we have zip lines, we have a nice little gazebo here. Um, you know, you can sit if you want to. And you can burn money. Because <laughs> it's not going to do you any good. Alright, and then somewhere here I usually have a cassette recorder, but... You know, so we can party. So we can get down. It's Friday, right? Alright, so. There's that. I'm going to equip this. And then basically you just set it somewhere. Oh. I need to... And here comes more turtles because it is morning time. You're not going to let me set it. morning time so with that being said <coughs> yeah it took me a while to do a lot of work on this camp but then uh, I allowed a couple of modders to come in and help me out that's the start of a roller coaster and, you know, one hooked me up with a bunch of hang gliders, and you go up to the top of that and jump off to hang glide. Um, pretty interesting, pretty fun. It, it takes a minute to get used to, that's for sure. Zip line's fun. Okay, and... Oh yeah, this I think this was another location for a gun part, if I remember correctly. But some of these waters you go swimming in, and you'll get eaten by a shark. Um, I'm just going to swim in here. I think I'm in the right area. We're going to swim over here. Like, this is player versus environment, and it is set on peaceful, but players can come in here and still kill you. Um, animals in the environment can still kill you. And there's no way to swim fast or anything like that. There, see, see that? The sh the sharks will come after you. Yeah, okay. So, uh, yeah. Oh, there was another one. I need to move in towards shore. What is that? 
Oh, this is one of the markings. Um, there we go. See, here's another cave that I I didn't mark. I automatically put my rebreather on. And is this the katana cave? I don't remember. It's it's been so long since I've done anything on the caves. But we'll go in here and take a look. This is... And you can just slide down if you hold your left joystick in. It's a long way down. That's all I can tell you. Okay. And this cave is creepy as fuck. Okay. And if you're under 18 and you hear me swearing, well, earmuffs, I guess. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, something went down here. So I got two crossbow bolts and... This might be where you get the crossbow. I already have it, so it's not showing up. Um, and you actually have to... Which which one? Which one? Um, yeah, there was something... that With one of these uh, pieces of paper here that... I can't remember, like, you were able to pick it up, or something like that, and... So yeah, I believe this is the crossbow cave. But, let's get out of here, and I'm gonna show you guys some more of how... Um, peaceful mode is not peaceful mode. So, we're gonna climb all the way back up here. I have to make sure I get myself something to eat. Okay. So now we got to go back through. I don't think there's anything across the way. I'm there might be though. I can't. I can't quite remember. It's been so long. But I like to adventure, as you guys can see. Um. Hmm. Well, and I can't break anything out. Yeah. So I'm guessing that's that's it. up out of the cave and swim my dude swim there you go so we'll get into shore here And 
I'm going to show you guys more of how... What was that? Did anybody else just see that? I'm going to have to slow that down when I edit. This game has been known to have weird entities flying around in it from time to time. So I was able to show you one example so far of how peaceful mode is not peaceful. I just wanted to do this because anybody who plays the forest and sees that somebody has their server set as peaceful is like, oh, that's on peaceful mode. They, they're afraid to play the game. Well, you know what? The environment is enough uh, for me. So, yeah. Okay, so now we can take the rebreather and everything off. So you just hold on the rebreather and you click your right trigger if you're using controller. Um, Alright, so it's time to break out the flintlock. Which obviously is the best weapon in the game. Let's get rid of the knife. And let's see. Nobody's on so far. Okay. So now we're going to go this way. Let's get rid of that. And one of my favorite locations in the game is up here. This was the second place that I started to build. Ow. And yeah, if you want to, you can break these down and get get stuff from them um you know but you obviously want to use your axe any any of your axes you take a, a swing at them and you can recover you know rocks sticks yeah and skulls and cloth Alright, so, map is right bumper, if you ever want to use it. Um, me, I, I want to... You always gotta eat something in this game. Um, you always want to keep an eye on that stuff. And, I always grab medicine too. Because I got bit by the shark. See how that red's going up now? Just by taking one of the meds. And, that's all you need is one med. Okay, so... <laughs> oh my god. And if this wasn't on peaceful, this village would be full um, of mutants and... yeah. But... and there's always stuff in these that you can grab. There's a rabbit. See, there's rope. And they respawn. So, there's a fire if you actually need to use it. Okay, but, um... And something that always falls... Oh my god. Every time I go by this tree, there's an entity or something, even though they're not here. Um... Oh. See? You, you can hear something's going on. Um, but yeah, pretty weird. Okay, so, I did turn up the graphics as well on this game for you guys. I don't know if anybody can tell or not, but, um, I wanted to see how it would play while recording, and it looks pretty crisp to me. Okay, so right down here is where I started my, my build. Um... You know, we got water here that obviously needs to fill up. I haven't been here in a while or hung out here in a while. So it will tend to get grown in. Um, but now, if we just hang out here for a little while, right? There's a turtle. If I'm hungry, turtles do spawn down here. 
but certain times of day um, there are alligators. So we may come back to this spot after I show you guys the wild boars and I mean this game it can be a challenge even with just the environment alone you know you already got to take care of yourself so and if we want to see some wild boar or want to hunt some wild boar there's usually plenty up here. Now I'm gonna crouch. And peaceful mode or not, these little boogers, they just come right at you. I already hear one. See right there. So I'm just going to give you an example. I'm actually going to just walk up to him. See how they get nasty? See? He's biting me. Where'd he go? And if you look at my health it does affect the health it's funny because they're afraid of you but at the same time they will come at you so I'm gonna run from them and then I'm gonna stand here see my health and did you see the blood on the screen so with that being said That, that was bad aim. I'm gonna crouch. Because crouching actually does help, see? Steadies you. Oh, that was sweet. I've never seen a kill happen like that. With the boar just leaping in the air from the bullet. So yeah, he's dead. But they put a lot of work into their... Their AI. I mean, even the meat. Look at the look at the meat. How the meat set up, the muscles and all that. It's it's pretty good. Okay, two meat collected, and that's what you get from them. Um, I don't need the hide. Not at this time. I have like hundreds of them um, at the main camp, but we will take advantage of this. Yeah, these are my my lights. My skull lights for nighttime. Okay, so that was example number two of how peaceful mode is not peaceful mode. Oh, what was that, a deer? Why do I keep looking at my pad? Okay, so this is the best axe right here. This axe. All right. And I have plenty of sticks right here. I'm full on sticks. But, um... Oh. There goes a deer. And we can eat some blueberries. And it looks like I have to take some medicine. And medicine you can pick up on the boat and... Um, other random places. Oh yeah, I can't pick up any more sticks. But, we're gonna... 
cook this hog. Um, just like in real life, leaves burn better than money. <laughs> okay. should be over here. There we go. Oops. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to show you example number three of how peaceful mode is not peaceful mode and for those of you that don't know that mountain back there is basically sitting on top of a secret laboratory the entrance to the secret laboratory is right over right over there where my axe head is pointing in the crater there's an entrance there but there's also an entrance up there um, where that yellow flag is in the side of the mountain. Um, so yeah, don't ever beat the game twice with the alternate endings. If you beat it, only beat it once. Either beat it once with, your, with the PC um, that you choose in the end game, or beat it with um, the laptop. Do not beat it with both. If you beat it with both, you will seal off both entrances and never be able to get back into the secret laboratory again, which I can't. So, <laughs> which kind of sucks. Had I known, I would not have beat the game twice. Okay, so it's now later in the evening. And sometimes these things just roll out of nowhere, too. I'm actually not sure if we'll see any alligators here right now. Um, however... I just want to give you guys three different examples. of why peaceful mode is not peaceful mode. Yeah, I, I have an explosive. You can make explosives as well in this game, which is awesome. There it is. They call it a plastic torch. Okay, so the moon's out now. And now you can see how my path is all lit up. Yeah, that's another cave entrance, which I've showed before. Okay, so we're going to go up this way real quick. Yeah, hopefully me hanging out here for a little bit will uh, help the water come back to these, which is basically how this game does. Okay, but we're going th right over this way. Actually, more this way.
then... Jesus. Okay, it's raining. So I still need to go over there. What the fuck is that? Ah! See? Alligators. I'm gonna let them bite me once. Just so you guys can see. Ow. Okay. Peaceful mode is not peaceful mode. Just saying. Like how I one shot him. And I'm cold, so I can't carry any more. Okay, yeah, four meat collected. You get four meat from the gators. Um, right now, I need to put this. And just do this. Pull your left trigger. And do it about four or five times. Now I'm warm. So that was example number three of how peaceful mode is not peaceful mode. I hear another gator. There he is. See him? So yeah. That's basically what I wanted to show everybody. When you go on to the forest servers and you see somebody has peaceful mode, that doesn't mean anything. There is no such thing as peaceful mode in the forest. Players can still kill you. Animals can still kill you. If I jump in that water and I don't come up, it will kill me. There is no such thing as peaceful mode in the forest. <laughs> okay, so that's just a little tip um, that I wanted to give you guys and I wanted to show you. So I thought it would be useful. And, you know, if you ever see Delta Server online, feel free to join me. I'm going to take some medicine. I'm going to actually drink alcohol. And that does help. And I'm going to eat a snack. And now I'm good to go. Back, back to health. Good to go, you know? So, yeah. But, um, alright. So now, we are going over here. Get away from the alligator. And basically, that's all there is for me to show you guys about servers that are on peaceful mode. Um, they indeed are not. I know I've said it, and I'll say it again. Peaceful mode is not peaceful mode. Okay? Alright, so with that being said, everybody, thank you for watching. And be sure to see what I have on my channel tomorrow. Because tomorrow will be the 100th video for my YouTube channel. I'm just happy about that and thought I would throw that in there. So... 
Thank you, everybody, for watching.